You ever felt like you had a hard time fitting in? I do. Um, I've always kind of had a hard time with that. I've struggled with whether I fit in and uh, feeling distant or disconnected from people. Um, that happens to me a lot. That's, that's a way that I feel a lot. But I wanted to tell you all a little bit about an experience that relates to this piece. Uh, a couple years ago, I went up to Wyoming to the Shoshone National Forest Mountains. And um, I went on a horse pack trip with a couple of guides. And I was the only other person that went. It wasn't a group of us or anything like that. It was just two guides and me and our horses. And we went into the Shoshone National Forest about 12 miles away from any roads, uh, any civilization at all, and um, made camp and just, I don't know, cooked everything over a fire and bathed in streams, um, slept in tents, and it was pretty... I mean, it was, it was an amazing experience. Uh, it was things like um, the, the freezing cold ice or snow melt streams rushing over your feet and, and as, you, as you fill your cup with it and um, the sound of the wind through all the trees and not a single sign of another human. No, no little bits of trash anywhere, no graffiti anywhere, nothing like that at all. Just you and, and nature and the animals that, that are all around you. And um, at one point, one of the guides and I rode horseback um, a few miles further into the mountains just by ourselves. And he set up to, to go fishing and I continued on by myself into the streams. And this is a depiction of where I went. Um, I, I walked up the stream to this area with this rock outcropping and all these trees, these evergreens and these cottonwoods and aspens everywhere. And the, the soft blue hills in the background just receding further and further into the distance. And there was no one else around. I was by myself. I knew where he was, but he was miles away from me now where he had set up and I'd gone on ahead and spent the whole day hiking. And it was an amazing experience because even though I was completely alone and probably the furthest away I've ever been from other human beings, um, it's like suddenly I felt like I belonged somewhere. Uh, it's like nature feels so huge and you feel so small in it, but at the same time, it's almost like you actually start to grow larger too. Like uh, you begin to fill the space that nature has made for you. And that's kind of the experience that I had in these mountains. Um, feeling like by disconnecting from all of the things that I'm used to being with, I was finally able to actually connect with myself, with creation, with nature, um, with all of the, the best values that I have as a person. Because those values included things like reverence and um, patience, gentleness, Nothing in these mountains is rushed. And so all of those, all those attributes come back to you. So what I'm painting is a depiction of some of those moments. Uh, at one point, we drove the, uh, the horses across the stream, just like I'm depicting here all of our packs on them and 
the guides up in the front and me following. And at one point it even began to rain and the thunder clapped and the horses spooked and they all kind of rushed together and galloped together in the, in the middle of the stream. And that was a difficult moment for me. I'm, I'm, I'm not the best horseman around. I'm competent, but I'm not super skilled. But this was at the end of the trip. And all of those days of learning patience and learning serenity and calm really um, became relevant in that moment. Because I didn't panic. I didn't give in to like some kind of immediate need for, for control. I was able to stay atop my horse and um, still feel connected to him. And it felt like um, instead of being out of control, it felt kind of like uh, just another moment to test myself. And I'm sure that that's something that, that these guys could handle every day like it's nothing. But to me, that's, that's an event. That's, that's just something I'm experiencing. So that's what's going on in this painting. Those are some of the things that I'm trying to depict a little bit in, in this painting. And I'm pretty pleased with how it's turned out. I hope you like it. Let me know.